Hey guys, it's Burgas here and in this video I'm going to check out the Hexandra. She is one of the best healers in the game right now and you can actually get her for free. She is part of your journey when you go over the different zones and basically part from your gameplay. There is a point, if I remember correctly, where you can get her basically for free. No need summon and is a hero that is guaranteed to be your. So yeah, let's check her out first the spells of this uh, hero. So the first spell is when healing aliens with the HP below 40%, the amount of healing is increased by 30%. This is very, very important because when you're, you, you most of the times is going to use healers when your heroes are going to die. And this increase of the amount of healing by 30% is very, very powerful and it can save your hero from dying very very great uh, skill and it's a passive skills going further heals the ally by 105 percent attack and 1500 percent alignment and dispel one debuff from there okay we also have a uh, dispelling somebody who is dispelling debuffs this is important because in this game there is a lot of debuffs and some of these debuffs can increase the enemy damage on you or maybe can lower your defense, can lower your attack, you get the idea. There is just a lot of buffs and this hero is providing with this spell. Yeah, this is very, very great. I mean, dispelling the debuffs or giving a buffs is very, very nice in this game. So going on the ultimate and this is my favorite ultimate. Look at this range, first of all, of the ultimate. She can catch basically the half of the map with this um, with this spell. Use the islands within the range for by 20% target maximum HP. Well, this is not so much 20%, but still is very very helpful. Even though her spells in general is just uh, healing, debuffing, and this is absolutely absolutely great. And you can use this hero further in the game. This hero can actually help you uh, develop your team and actually go through the stages very, very easy. It can be dungeons, it can be battles, it can be whatever. Now, some people are going to ask me, well, why don't you level up this hero? Well, I get lucky and I actually get other hero that is uh, close to this one. And this is this one, Questa. This is the reason I actually didn't level up um, her, I mean the Nexandra, is just because I have this one. And I'll explain why. First of all, every time the enemy die dies, grants recover over time to all allies. Restore HP over time for 10 seconds. And this uh, healing over time, I find it to be very, very good, very, very strong. And I don't actually need a healer in my team. Now this hero is not actually a healer. <laughs> she actually do a pretty decent amount of damage. Charges to the enemy within the walls HP dealing 420% attack, uh, necrotic damage and blah blah blah. This is the reason because I get from this one very good attack. And I get extra very good ultimate. And I get healing and this healing is enough for me to proceed further in the game very very strong hero this is the reason I don't have a Hexandra it's just I don't need a healing that much but if you don't get any epic hero or other hero that actually provide you with a passive healing and doing great damage I think Hexandra can be great and I definitely will go for her for the long battles where I actually need strong healing because she is doing very very nice healing. So yeah, this is so far my video for Hexandra, absolutely great hero. You can use it, use this hero further further in the game. I think she's a great. You get her for free just by doing your quest and exploring the map. This is absolutely great and I love games that actually provide you with very good heroes to actually support your process through the game and this is one of them. 
So I guess this will be for this video guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you do, hit one like, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video.